Welcome back everybody, it's time to continue on with our Popper League with our Slivers deck. Uh, deck list is below in the description if you want to check it out. This is game three, we're one and one right now. And we finally get a decent opening hand, so we will keep it. They're going first. And I've seen this card like pretty much every game, it's crazy. Another planes, okay. Drop her flanking, we'll pass it on. We got a winding way if things get crazy. Urza's Tower, okay. So we're troning it here. Okay, don't flood me out now. Alright, we gotta go Heavy Lord then, start getting in damage early. Oh, you. If we don't pass our attack step, that's the second time I've done that. Now it's like glitched out. Great. That is the second time I've done that this week. Just clicked right through it. Wow, I'm like clicking it as I'm clicking the guy to attack, and then it gets stuck. That's how like trigger happy I am on both my stuff. All right. Well, they can find their third Tron. It's unfortunate. Yep. Give me another Lord. We need the extra pressure here. Evelyn Bodyguard is not exactly what we want to see. Um, well, we'll throw them out there. Oh, no, we're not going to do that yet. Cancel. We're going to Winding Way first. Alright. Well, that's, that's nicer. Now we'll put them out. Do not skip my attack. Thank you. Unfortunately, they should be down by an extra couple points of damage. But we're gonna have a very good drop next turn. Have a lot of pressure on the board. So, I still feel pretty good. I'm not super worried about what I'm seeing. These are beautiful lands. How come I've never seen those before? Ow, which version is this from? It's wonderful. I need those. That's going to be the... If I can find that artwork, that'll be on the thumbnail. That one right there. It's cool looking. It's hard to find the artwork sometimes. Google can only take you so far. Oh, ghostly flicker my butt, man. Oh, no. It's the last kind of Tron I want to go up against right now. The Ghostly Flicker Tron. Yep, here comes the combo. Uh, yep. I need a journey. I need a journey right now. Not a journey. Combo's coming soon. Uh, we'll probably see it next turn. If they stall out right here, though, we can kill them. But uh, they have Tron, and they have their two of their pieces. Let's see if they have their their third. Their uh, what were they? Xnay all uh, damage. Might be searching. Oh, they just brought it in. Okay. Another Urza's. What are we going to see? I'm going to wait. crossing my fingers that they don't have it. That is all. Mm. 
<clears throat> My only guess is they're thinking of how they can get out of this most effectively. Uh, the way they're taking so long makes me think maybe they don't have it, but... Alright. Sending it back to me. Journey is pretty good. Let's see if we can get away with doing this. Can I get away with this? Even if they like ghostly flicker it. Gotta try, right? I, I don't know if this is not gonna be as effective as I'm thinking. I get to draw some more cards, but just don't know if this is gonna be enough to save them still. Taps them out. Game two? Yeah? Yeah? No? Do they have it? Uh, cycling? Okay. Fair enough. Alright. Game two. Thank goodness. Whew. Didn't want to be stuck in that matchup. Uh, definitely this. Relic? Is Relic going to be good in this? I think it might be pretty useful, actually. Damage is not really going to help us. We can take out a Journey. We can take out a Sentinel. We can take out a Spinneret. Take out Benevolent, actually. Yeah, we can take out all the Benevolent. Let's bring back in... Uh... Hmm... Just bring back in one journey, maybe? Journey doesn't hit a ton, though. Not a ton. I think we do need to stay creature heavy. I guess let's just bring out... Bring back our sentinel. Yeah. Let's, let's do that. Alright. I like it. We will keep. It's not... A ton of damage on the board yet. Expedition map. So they're already going to be able to find their pieces, more than likely. <sighs> I don't need another relic, though. No thanks. Need more lords. We're not going to win if we don't have a lot of power on the board fast. So drawn into lords would be nice. Other vines. Not exactly what I'm looking for either. Well that sucks. That absolutely sucks. So we can start cracking these, get some card draws at least, if they're not being useful to us.
exactly what we're looking for either. I may crack one of these relics at the end of their turn. Just for the card draw. Not yet. We'll wait. This is going to resolve. Good. Good, good. Ooh, it is storming outside right now. Hopefully, you guys can't hear that thunder. Now, if we can get another forest, maybe we can start blasting in with some kicked vines. That might be nice. Fortunately, they have a lot they can do now. Skips their next combat phase. Oh, please. That's terrible. Sure, hit me for two. in hand I want to see if winding way will resolve here and we hit absolutely nothing so that's awesome skipped our combat step See if this gets countered. No? Alright. Tells me maybe they've got uh, the card. Let's see. Yep. Here it is. Moment of peace. Prevent all combat damage. Wonderful. Flash that back again. Actually, no, this is good. We can relic it out of here. Oh, are they just going to kill us right now? Oh, they're going to kill us right now, aren't they? Oof. Yep, 14. Lovely. All right. Well, we had a way out of it, but they had their their game card. Uh, I still like what we have going on, so let's keep that. 
Relic would have been exactly what we needed there in that position. If they didn't have their, their card to clean up the game, we could have relic uh, it out at the end of their turn. Or before anything else at the graveyard, I should say. Would have been good. This is an absolutely terrible hand. Alright, well... This isn't that much better either, but we'll keep it. Get rid of the planes. my draw. What do we got? Alright, there's still stuff we can do, but... Now we need our forest. They are getting their pieces cranking. Give me it, give me it. Come on, this is how we win. Yes, alright, good. Very good. Pressure's on. Gotta move fast. Okay. We're gonna cycle this now, try to find a lord. Oh, Sidewinder. Neither of these are crazy helpful, but they are bodies. That's going to help us for the upcoming turns. Going to three. Couple poisonous on the board. Let's close this out quick. Come on. Do they have Tron? That's a lot. Okay, we're skipping our next combat step. Time to refill with Winding Way. <sighs> now we're just going to stop our board. Go ahead. Take your extra turn. You got three life. If they can't find Tron here, it, it might be over for them. If they find Tron, they might have a chance. Okay, sure, we're looking for it, and they found it, schematic, but is it enough, I don't think there's much else they can do here. No, yes, what can you do with two? Three. Oh, that one's only cost two. I thought that one cost more for some reason. All right. No worries. You got an extra turn out of it. For some reason I was thinking that was more expensive. I don't pay attention to the mana costs like I should. Pulling a relic would be nice. Still going to give him an extra turn, though. They got seven cards, so you can uh, still do quite a bit. I say that a lot. There's the wall. Great. Yep. Flicker. We need to disrupt that ASAP. We can vines it uh, so they can't target it. Still a lot they can do. Wait. They tap themselves? Am 
Am I missing something? Oh, they brought him back too. I missed that. My bad. They ghostly flickered him and... Okay. Brought him back. I skipped my combat step. Alright. For a second there, I was like, wait, they're tapped out. Hold on. What? <laughs> Last time I played this deck, they didn't play with this uh, Dignitary card. Something we can do except sit and wait for now. Until we get something that uh, can disrupt this whole thing. This whole mess. Did we take out journey? We did take out a couple journeys. Took out one journey. Or no, we took out two. Sorry. Forgot we uh we have four in the, the main board now. Vines, okay. So we gotta figure out how to correctly do this here. So we need to target one of their things so it can't be hit by a ghostly flicker. Which one's gonna be the best one to target? Because both of them are important. We can target the, the wall so they can't get Ghostly Flicker back. That might be best. Ghostly Flicker will still hit the Dignitary. We'll still skip a combat step next turn. Pretty sure this is how we need to run it. It's not to say they, they may still have another ghostly, ghostly flicker in their hand, which could very well be the case. If that's the case, well, it is what it is, but... Not worried about skipping the combat step too much just because they already have moments peace, so that's not gonna matter. Almost had him. They had him at three. we can really do except play out our hand a little bit. Natural stay, that would have helped us anyways. Do they have another ghostly flicker? If they do, that's tough. <laughs> another ghostly flicker oh that's awesome dang dude we'll go a couple more bouts here uh, I don't want to be in here a crazy amount of time all right so they're just doing this like a madman now it's crazy Drawing all the cards they want. Trying to find their game ender. I'm gonna let them. I mean, we can maybe shut them down another turn, too. They just got so much stuff, it's it's pretty much game over. It's unfortunate. It's not talking, is he? No. That's unfortunate. Awesome, man. 
awesome. Six life. Awesome. triggers for days i'm gonna go one more turn and then i'll concede guys i don't want to be here all day like i did last time oh, excuse me ah, i gotta sneeze so much today yeah i don't want to be here all night and uh, this person's already showed that they are proficient with the deck and they know how to find their their game ender pieces they have so much in hand it, it's gonna take us a bajillion years just to get just to get through all of it, so we'll see what our draw is, and if it's nothing important, we'll just concede to them, because if they don't kill us here, which they're going to kill us here, so that's fine. We'll give them a GG. Yeah, they're proficient, so I didn't want to hang on long either. I just want to see the next card and let them have it, because they're good with the deck. They know how to run it. So good job to them. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. We are now one and two, unfortunately. Had our bouts with some crappy mulligans, and, uh, this game, we almost had them. We just have to push through damage. We have to be really, really fast with them. And once they get their combo pieces, it's really hard to get, get away from it. So, we've got stuff to disrupt it, but it's, you gotta have the perfect draw against it, too. You gotta be ready for when those pieces come out. And it's, uh, it can be tough, because if you don't have it, then you're just kind of screwed and you're locked in like this. Dignitary's a new one, though. That was cool to see that one. Uh, that, I think, works really good in this deck. Last time I, last couple times I played this deck, it, it wasn't in there. Opponent skips their combat step. Almost works better than, uh, Moment's Peace. You just Mnemonic Wall and Dignitary back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Till day's end, until you find, uh, what's this thing called? The Torch? Yeah. Pretty cool. Anyways... We will see you guys in the next video for round number four. Stay tuned, leave a like, and we will see you guys then. See you later.